Can the warden survive the maximum fall distance in Minecraft? Let's test it out. It actually does. The warden is the strongest mob in the game. And apparently a witch can survive two of them at the same time. In fact, it can because of the way witches were programmed. Apparently having invisibility doesn't trigger skulk sensors, which as you can see is false. Hoppers can collect items through mud blocks. This is actually true. Swift sneak three is faster than normally walking, which after comparing the two, I can say that this is false. It is said that running these four commands will give you secret new paintings. True, this is what they look like. Maybe it's hinting towards a future update. Naming your seed, I want ancient city places one under spawn. Okay, I just loaded in. Let's check this out. There actually is. What? Normally, they're thousands of blocks away from spawn. You can bypass skulk sensors by spring jumping and then crouching, which is somehow true. Apparently, Mojang secretly added the Moo Bloom, and summoning lightning on a mushroom will spawn it in. Let's test it out. It changes color, but it's not the Moo Bloom. This is obviously fake. Fireflies were removed from the new update, but I heard you can still spawn them in using a command, which is not working. This is false. Apparently, water deactivated skulk sensors. They are now covered in water. I've been jumping and making noise, but the warden is not spawning. This is true. The warden is an undead mob. However, it is said that it is actually immune to the sun, which is correct, making the warden the first undead mob to not burn in the day. Diamonds will always spawn under mud, which there actually was. Let me try this again. Nope. And yes, I'll say this is kind of true. Reinforced deep slate is unbreakable, which after mining for over a minute, I can say that this is false. Mud allows you to run underwater. This is what swimming at the bottom normally looks like and this is it with mud this is actually true what does adding ice make you run faster under the water this one is false exploding ores now drops xp let's try this out it does. This can make for some interesting farms. You can now trap fish in leaf blocks. It doesn't seem to work like this. I think I may need to do it like this. And it works. Poor guy. Apparently, the birch forest was removed from the game. However, I can still locate it. But when teleporting, it is gone. No, I'm just kidding. It is definitely still here for me. This is false. I don't know why people thought this. It is said if I open this chest in the ancient city, there should be a golden apple. Which is right. And if I take it down here and eat it, a secret door will open. And it does. I wonder if this room means anything. You can shoot projectiles through the new mangrove trap door snowballs don't work eggs don't work arrows don't work this is busted the warden can actually be disabled through a command correct skulk sensors can't hear wool i'm walking and making noise and it's not doing anything this is true and skulk sensors hear carpet it's not triggering anything using carpets either i think this is why ancient cities are filled with wool and carpets the warden is the health of a wither and ender dragon combined the wither's health is 300 and the ender dragon's health is 200 combined makes 500 and the warden's health is 500 but this is true the warden is by far the strongest mob in the game. Bundles were secretly added in the new update. I can give myself one through command. However, you cannot get them in survival. So I would say this myth is true and false. Wearing mob heads now protect you from hostile mobs. I now have a zombie head on and the zombie is still going after me. Now I have a skeleton head and he is still shooting me. Safe to say this is busted. Apparently no mobs spawn in the deep dark biome. I'm in one and I actually don't see any mobs. However, the caves around it do. And after waiting a couple minutes, none still spawn so this is true water bottles put you out of fire in the nether i'm on fire let's test it out it does not seem to work maybe if i use it to make mud nope this is false goats can actually lose a horn by running into a wall this is true it even removes it from their model and apparently wardens can't hear when you use a goat horn which is definitely wrong there's a super rare blue frog like the rare blue axolotl but after spawning many in all the different biomes and checking commands i can likely say that this is false the new block skull catalyst multiplies whenever a mob nearby dies however it is said that the ender dragon has no effect to this and after killing the ender dragon i can say that this is true you can clutch with the new skulk veins i tried many attempts but was never successful so i believe this is fake there is a new blue magma block i'm just kidding i made this with the skulk veins the warden's sonic boom goes through block i hate to say this but it's true i don't know how this is fair frogs can eat magma cubes which is somehow true even though they're basically the same size as each other frogs cannot drown they can in real life though so let's test this out it's been a while now and they're not drowning it could just take a very long time but i can't wait that long i would just say this is true the wither can 
kill a warden in a fight. There's only one way to test this out. The fight has begun. The warden is doing insane damage to the wither and destroyed him. That literally lasted like five seconds. Will he die to the withering effect? Nope. This myth was a busted. Allies are invincible when holding items. Let me give this one a flower and now try to kill it. It is actually not working. This is true. We now know frogs can eat magma cubes, but can 1,000 frogs eat the warden? Unfortunately, not. You can mark your location on a map with banners. If I rename this banner and then place it and right click the map on it, it works. My map labeled my location. It even shows it on item frames. Apparently, the warden can't leave water. Let's test this out. I'm making noise and he's on to me, but he can't seem to get out at all. The warden is legit trapped in the water. <laughs> what? This is surprisingly true. You can convert a vex into an ally using milk. I tried this several times and the vex did nothing. This is false. You get more XP from deep slate ores. After mining all these regular diamonds, I have nine levels. And after mining all the deep slate diamonds, I have eight levels. I actually got more levels off the regular diamonds. This is false. You can drain all the water out of mud to turn it into clay using this contraption. It does take some time, but it does work. You can basically make infinite clay from this. Renaming a frog a Jeb underscore makes it randomly cycle through all the other biome colors like it does to the sheep. But when naming all of them, you can see that this is fake. Renaming a warden Gloden gives it the glowing effect. I've seen this work for some people, so let's try it. It does not seem to be glowing. Apparently, it glows behind walls, but that doesn't work either. All the videos you saw on this was unfortunately a lie. Came to dogs, take two warden hits to die. This is actually true. What? That is more than a normal player in full diamond armor. Dogs are crazy strong. Zombies can't jump over azalea bushes. I'm surrounded by azalea bushes with several zombies around me, and none of them can get in. This is perfect for protecting your house. Opening to land enables cheats without actually enabling them with this button. But as you can see, this is not working. This is false. Several articles say that the warden is a blind mob, but when viewing his perspective in spectator, he can see everything just fine. But we don't know if spectator Spectator works like that, so I'll say this is a maybe. Apparently, XP bottles distract the warden. So if I throw one here, he should follow it. And he does. This is true. Do snowballs distract the warden? Will he follow it? He does. This is true as well. Alays can actually mine diamonds for you. So it is said if I give him diamonds, will he mine these? It does not seem to be working. Maybe I need to give him a pickaxe instead? This is not working either. I don't think I'm doing anything wrong. I think it's safe to say that this is false. The warden cannot burn. Let's build a lava pit for him. And now let's test it. He's legit not burning at all. What if I try hitting him with fire aspect on my sword? This isn't working. Maybe if I try shooting him with flame on my bow? Nope. Not even enchants work on the warden. I hate to say it again, but this is true. The warden is basically invincible. Frogs can eat goats. They can eat magma cubes, which are bigger than them, so I wouldn't be surprised if they do. But it looks like this is false. You can call goats to come to you using one of their goat horns. <laughs> I don't see any of them coming to me. This is not true. Mangrove trees do not drop saplings. Correct. The only way to grow them is through the propagals on them. Can you grow 4x4 four four propagals into big mangroves like you can with saplings? You cannot. Propagals can be grown underwater. True. Saplings can now be placed and grown on mud. This is correct. Tropical fish spawn in mangrove swamps. It took me some time to find them, but this is true. Placing torches disables the warden from spawning. I have many torches down, and the warden is still spawning. This is definitely false. That was busting 64 minutes in 1.19. Comment your favorite one and thank you for watching.